Breaking news just into our newsroom moments ago today. FWC confirming that preliminary results do indicate that red tide is in Palm Beach County waters. It all comes after water samples were taken by FWC off coastal waters in the last couple of days. FWC going on to say that red tide on the east coast of Florida is extremely rare. It can even subside and then reoccur. The duration of the bloom in near shore Florida waters really depends on physical and biological conditions that influence growth, they say. Meanwhile, beaches all across Palm Beach County and Martin County, they remain closed at this hour. Just added within the last few hours, the city of Riviera Beach adding local beaches within Riviera, those names to the already very long list. An unknown irritant we now know is likely red tide is causing people to get sick at several spots. It was happening all weekend long here right now a rundown of exactly which beaches are closed at the moment in Palm Beach County. This is from the northern county line all the way to Lake Worth Beach, so no swimming is allowed at Peanut Island at the moment until at least tonight at six o'clock. And like we said, Riviera Beach just made that decision to close all of its beaches as a precaution this afternoon. That was before the FWC notice came out just moments ago. That all happened about two o'clock this afternoon. Meanwhile, Phil Foster Park is open at the moment. We'll get an update on that in Martin County. Meanwhile, the four guarded beaches right now are unguarded. People are being told to swim at their own risk. The beaches include Jensen Beach, Stewart Beach, Bathtub Beach, and Hope Sound Beach as well. County leaders say they'll be monitoring conditions. They'll be reassessing this afternoon, and I'm sure mulling over that word out of FWC just moments ago.